I'm Jenny. I'm the co-founder of Acro Yoga, and we're talking about good pain versus bad pain. So there's many kind of ways we can relate to this sensation of pain, right? So the sensation itself is fairly neutral, and it's oftentimes how we relate to the sensation that gives it the quality of pleasure or pain. If we're talking on a purely, you know, anatomical, biochemical level, oftentimes in yoga, you know, we're pushing, we're doing a posture, and it's exertion, it's work. And there can be a question of, is this pain good for me? Like, am I building muscle or is it bad for me? Am I actually hurting myself in this process? And one concrete way to look at it is if we're working in our muscles, then that's a fairly safe place to build. If you feel pain in your joints, that can often be a place where we don't want to add stress in that moment. If we want to look at it on a bigger level, we can ask ourselves, whatever sensation I'm feeling, is it at an appropriate edge? And an appropriate edge is a place where I can breathe into it. And when I'm in a very intense sensation, I ask myself, can I soften around this? So is the sensation itself bringing more tension or can I lessen the tension? Can I soften around that? And oftentimes a really great tangible tool is what we call the inner smile. So it's just a very soft, like if you almost imagine a Buddha sitting under the Bodhi tree where he attains enlightenment, it's just this very soft inner knowing and sending, even just making that small adjustment in our physicality can bring a sense of calmness, a sense of joy, and a sense of ease into any situation. So one phrase that I really love that works really well for me is, pain is mandatory, suffering is optional. So whether it's in our practice, whether it's in our physical body, or in a relationship, a situation in life, asking myself, okay, life can be hard sometimes, things come up, am I adding suffering to that? Am I adding judgment? Am I adding fear? Am I adding resistance to something that just is in and of itself fairly neutral? So sometimes we can lose our job or a relationship ends and that can either be a tragedy or it can be an opportunity. And that's really about our mind and how we choose to view that situation. So every moment in our lives is an opportunity to go into something that can feel dark and turn it into an opportunity to see the light.